Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has been testing a brand new feature in Edge Canary, which is currently sitting on version 119, where in Edge Canary you have a new option that Microsoft rolled out um, early in August last month. You have a new option to export your browsing data, which uh, is currently on a controlled rollout. And how you get to this uh, new feature is, um, as an example, you head to your history button if you have it activated in your toolbar. And if you open up that fly out menu and that hub, if you head to the three dotted menu, more options, and you click on that, you'll see export browsing data. Now, as an example, if we head over to the stable version and we do the same, we only get these three options. And obviously now in Edge Canary, uh, we get that fourth option now that lets you export your browsing data. Now, as mentioned, this export browsing data um, started rolling out in preview um, early in August. And very useful, um, as the name implies, you can export your browsing data and then obviously as a backup or if you want to um, import that into another browser as an example. Now, um, just to let you know that um, recently now in Edge Canary, um, Microsoft has added a warning now when trying to export your browsing data. So if you click on that, you'll see this new warning. Um, your browsing data, they say, will be visible to anyone who has access to the exported file. Exporting your browsing data may take time. Please wait for a few minutes and then check the exported file uh, directly. So this is just a ba basically Microsoft giving a heads up that obviously uh, if anyone gets that um, file that you have exported, um, which is your browsing data, obviously that could be a privacy concern. So just giving you a heads up there and then obviously that it could take some time and so on. So And then obviously you click on export and that will export your browsing data uh, down to your local drive, which you can then import um, into another browser if you are moving on from Edge or want to work in a couple of different browsers. But I um, just wanted to let you know because um, I do know a lot of you do use um, Microsoft Edge and are interested in some of these new features and I think that's a handy feature and when it comes to your browsing history and being able to export that browsing data. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.